Hi, I'm Lisa Valenti, Registered Dietitian with Healthline. Let's talk about carbs, specifically what you need to know about carbohydrate counting when you have diabetes. The amount of carbohydrates you need to eat is going to be personal to you. Some people with diabetes prefer to follow a low carb diet, while some choose a more moderate carbohydrate level. You have to find the amount of carbohydrates that works best for you and helps keep your blood sugar in your target range. There are different ways to assess your intake. Some people prefer knowing every gram, and some people may count in carb servings. One carb serving is about 15 grams of carbs. In the beginning, you'll likely want to measure your food out, but as you continue, you may be able to start eyeballing or estimating portions. Testing your blood sugar after meals and snacks is a helpful way to see how the foods you eat are impacting your sugar levels to help you dial in your food choices. The amount of carbohydrates you eat is important, but so is the type of carbs you choose and what you pair them with. Eating refined carbohydrates on their own can cause bigger spikes in your blood sugar. Choosing more complex carbohydrates and pairing them with protein and fat can help with more stable blood sugar because fiber and protein take longer to digest. So think apple with peanut butter over white bread with jelly. It's also key to maintain consistent levels throughout the day. So you wouldn't wanna save up your daily carbs for a big ice cream sundae at dinner, but rather space out some carbohydrates at every meal. This helps your blood sugar levels stay more even so you don't see big spikes or drops. Tracking your carbohydrate intake with an app can be very helpful. There's many free apps available. You download them right to your phone, you enter in your food, and you can track your carbs throughout the day. While carbohydrates are the main focus when you have diabetes, you also can get a bigger nutrition picture and learn about fats, protein, fiber, sugars, and sodium. If you take insulin, you want to match the amount of carbohydrates you consume to your dose of insulin. So talk to your healthcare practitioner to make a plan. To learn more about diabetes, carbohydrates, and how to eat, check out healthline.com.